Hey, what's up everybody? It's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to save a copy of all notifications on Android. Now Android does have a little setting shortcut that lets you view recently posted notifications, but it doesn't keep them for very long, and there's not much detail for each notification. This is why developer Cylon created an app called Notifications Logger, which keeps detailed logs of all your notifications and can save them indefinitely, even when you switch ROMs or phones. To get this one going, you don't need to be rooted. You just need to have unknown sources enabled in your phone settings under security so that you can sideload the app. From there, head to step one in my full tutorial on Gadget Hacks to download the APK. Then when that's saved to your device, tap to download complete notification. Next, just press install, then go ahead and open the app when that's finished. And when you first launch Notifications Logger, you'll be asked to enable an additional permission for the app. This will be a little different depending on your Android version. So on 4.2 or lower, it'll use an accessibility service, but on 4.3 or higher, it'll just ask for notification access. But either way, just tap OK on this first message, then it'll take you to the proper Android settings menu. From here, select the accessibility option on 4.2 or lower, or choose the notification access option on newer Android versions. After that, it should be about the same regardless of your Android version. So simply enable the notification logger option, then press allow on the pop-up. At this point, the notification logging is active, but it's not retroactive. So you have to wait on some new notifications to come through before they start showing up in your log. But from now on, whenever you get a notification, it'll be saved in notifications logger. So at any time, if you want to go back and see a notification that you missed, just open the app and you'll see all of your notifications ordered by time and categorized by the app that posted them. If you want to see more details about the notification, just tap the entry and you can see the actual notification as it appeared when you first received it. Let's say there's some apps whose notifications you don't want to save. If that's the case, just head to the main screen and tap the three dot menu button, then choose settings. From here, go to log notifications, then select the apps entry. This will let you add certain apps to your blacklist so that they won't show up in your notification log. And that's as easy as selecting any apps and pressing OK. Then finally, you can even export your notification logs to a file, which can then be imported onto a different device or ROM. To do that, just tap the three dot menu button from the main screen and choose backup to save the file. From there, just transfer the file onto your new device or ROM then install this same app and use the restore feature to get your notification history back. So it's a very useful app if you like to keep tabs on your notifications, and it's pretty easy to install and set up. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article over on GadgetHacks.com. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.